I believe it used to be a Toyota Corolla. <laughs> Something like that, but now it's a wrecked car with a message. How this car is teaching about the dangers of distracted driving. And we have heard warnings time and time again about the dangers of distracted driving. And as new specialist Keith McCord reports, now there's a visible example of the consequences of that making the rounds in Utah. Keith? Thousands of motorists in Utah get hurt every year because they're not paying attention. This car is driving home the point that we need to keep our eye on the road. Uh, I believe it used to be a Toyota Corolla. <laughs> It's a bashed up Corolla now with a crunched front end, deployed airbag, and it's still on the road, sort of. Bear River Mutual Insurance, Larry Miller Collision Services, and Terry's Towing are moving this car from place to place to illustrate what can happen when a driver is distracted. Uh, we see it a lot here at the Collision Center, and uh, people don't know how quickly accidents can happen. We, you know, we do business across the state of Utah, and so we're going to focus on, on trying to help uh, get this message out across the state, uh, especially with younger drivers. The latest stats from the Utah Department of Public Safety show that about 12% of all crashes are due to distracted drivers, and those under the age of 24 have the highest rate of distracted driving accidents. Types of distractions are ranked this way in Utah. Drivers on cell phones top the list, followed by other inside-the-car distractions, passenger distractions, external distractions, and fiddling with the sound system. So to draw attention, you know, to the problem with a, with a brightly colored car that's, that's been in an accident uh, certainly uh, helps, helps get the message across a little bit better. Yeah, we take it to different, different events, bees games, uh, University of Utah football games, Fourth of July parades, things like that. And the plan is to do more events like that, especially those involving young people. We've heard the warnings many times about paying attention on the road. This campaign hopes an up-close look at this leaves an impression. And I think in a lot of cases, we just need to repeat it often enough uh, in enough different ways and, and through enough different avenues that people really start to get the message. Distracted driving accidents will never go away completely, but the companies behind this effort hope that if this bashed up car can help save even one life, then that's a step closer to zero fatalities on our highways. Keith McCord, KSL 5 News, Sandy. Good message. You don't want your car to end up like that. No, no. not at all. Kevin's back.